as said Hereford in their white shirts, black shorts and white socks, Kettering in all red. Kettering goalkeeper in all yellow, Brandon Hall's in his fluorescent orangey colour. The referee just getting things ready to go here at Edgar Street. National League North action. And uh, all the players taking a knee just before kickoff as well. Gets a warm round of applause from those here at Edgar Street. And we're underway, Kettering shooting left to right in this first half. And uh, Hereford towards the Blackfriars stand right to left as Hodgkiss just launches this one into the top of the Len Weston stand. <laughs> They're a good six foot plus. And he's gone all the way towards the near post. Brandon Hall comes out and punches clear. It drops for Gary Stower. Back out again to Reece Sharp on the left-hand side. Covered by Tom Owen Evans, who gets a good block in and takes that one away for a corner and the first of the game, only 45 seconds in from this near side. Then Reece Sharp lays it up towards the far post. Brandon Hall couldn't get his right fist onto it. Knocks over the bar and out for a goal kick into the meadow end at Sales. I think that's why a lot of teams go for short ones. Tom Owen Evans, though, going to right foot this one in towards the box, put it into the mix, drops down for Gordon, it doesn't drop kindly for him. Haynes will just nod this one straight to a Kettering man and on chases Callum Powell onto the end of this one, of course, scored a brace hit last season. To quickly picked up Lloyd, down to McLean on the left-hand side, shouts for the offline flag to go up. No offside given as McLean now charges across the byline, keeps it going really well here, dropped down by... Luke O'Neill with a great challenge up towards the halfway line it goes flicked on and Haynes will play this one safely back to Brandon Hall 20 yards away from the touchline headed in out for a corner Brandon Hall had to watch at his near post he's now on the corner on this near side left footed into the box it goes towards the far post up goes the head of Connor Kennedy it's still loose and bouncing around in the area out for another corner as the strike was made by McDonough Trying to get it back to Hodgkiss. Slipped over but does really well to retrieve the ball again. Owen Evans, left-footed cross in towards the box. And towards Gordon, drops nicely from McLean. If he can get a strike away, he's got three men to get put oh, first. Oh, oh. Slips over as he tries to get the shot away. And uh, almost the run of Callum Powell set him free. But Ando did well to cover McLean. Back to Ando again. Lovely bit of footwork from Ando. Gets the strike away, drags it low. Dan Smith, offside. offside. Oof. Well, offside Dan Smith as he taps it home. He couldn't have had an easier goal, really. It's uh, lovely work from Ando. Scuffed his shot in the end, trying to bring it to the halfway line in the centre circle. McLean lets this one go through towards Gordon. Shouts for offside. Gordon will come over to the near side and chase. Does well to get oh. the ball, and a, a big challenge goes in. Gordon falls to the floor. The that's referee. A, that's got to be a booking. He's going to wave a, some players it's away. Luke. Be a booking. Luke Ward wasn't playing the ball. He scooped at Yanni Gordon here. He's just... And there's a fair few players coming round to... He's just smashed him. And uh, getting himself ready. Left arm in the air. Goes for the low-driven cross. Into it's, it's, in, it's, in. it's in! What a free kick from Tom Owen Evans. He went low. He went to the near post. And it snuck in past Reese Davis. And it's the opening goal of the fixture this evening here at Edgar Street. Tom Owen Evans. In the lead. McLean now runs away to the halfway line. Skips past Luke O'Neill. Still going. He's got three men to his left hand side. McLean, if he wants to use one of them, to Tom Owen Evans it goes. Gets the strike away. It's blocked. And everyone was so far forward, no one was there on the edge of the area to pick it up. As it's turned by Gary Stower to the left-hand side with Alex Brown. Brown now trying to beat Dan Smith for pace and does so, gets the ball in towards the box, headed on. Over the bar and out, Jordan Crawford got his head onto it. Owen Evans the only man. Free shot on goal from 25 yards, yes please. <laughs> See they're creeping, they're creeping, they're, ne they're never 10 yards. Haynes is making a run across that wall as well of five men. Tom Owen Evans goes for the strike. It takes a deflection off the wall out for a corner. This one through over to Hodgkiss on this near side now. It goes too far past him, but it's well watched and hips in towards the area. McLean tries to run in against Luke O'Neill. Go on out, cover, and try and clear this one away down the touchline. Keeps it in play, then as far as Lloyd. Down towards Tom Owen Evans, turns away. McLean now gets past his man on the left. He's come towards the byline, drops this one back to Lloyd, and it's in from Gordon! 
He couldn't miss from two yards out, and Yanni Gordon gets his first goal for the Bulls. Celebrates in front of the meadow end. It's 2 0 now to Hereford and a bit of a way back for Kettering. Yanni Gordon stabs home and makes it two. Mead with a hat trick, White with a hat trick, Hemp with a hat trick, and Russo with a hat trick. Gordon through again here, but towards the edge of the area he goes, goes close towards the near post. Out for corner once again. Maybe took the ball a bit too far towards goal. Yeah, too many touches on it, just kept running away from him then making the angle worse it should have been a little, possibly a little more direct and headed inwards so down the near touch line headed away at the first attempt Lloyd goes up for a header as well drops nicely for Dan Smith up towards the edge of the area Dan Smith plays it through Tomo and Evans what a goal he makes it three and that's got to put the game past Kettering now what a lovely first time finish Tomo and Evans in the back of the net it goes again second goal of the game he's got a brace he's on a hat trick 3-0. Good finish, wasn't it? Oh, took it first time. Good play by Dan Smith. Really direct. Got the ball down. Run at the back four. Afraid to commit themselves in the box, weren't they? Just slotted it across to Owen Evans. What, what his job is. Goes about his job correctly. But it's just one of those. Ball down towards McLean on the edge of the area. Sorry to interrupt. He's going to skip this one back. Tom Owen Evans on a hat-trick. Gets the strike away. Oh, Good block a, on the line. What a head. What a headed clearance. That's hurt. He's still down. And uh, I think it's Luke Ward gets back onto his feet now denies Tomo and Evans of a hat-trick come down the touchline Hodgkiss will win the initial header cleared high into the air though by the substitute and Gary Stowe also shot comes in from Hodgkiss parried by the goalkeeper Reese Davis had to cover over to McLean on the left-hand side if he can skip past a few players himself might open up a strike on his right foot does so and it bobbles in front of Reese Davis but straight into his hands Making his presence known on the left-hand side on the wing. Ball down the right-hand side. In the meantime, Brandon Hall comes out to cover. His Crawford still gets an opportunity. Brandon Hall has to rush back into goal. Back out to Afozu again. Ball into the box, blocks away. And Kuyar will put his laces through and clear up to Gordon, who might have a chance to run. Ishmael in acres of space on the left-hand side. It's clicked over to him. He's got an opportunity on the edge of the area to try and flick it into his right. Instead goes further wide. Tries to cut in himself, Ishmael. Still going with the ball, gets it on his left, blocked away, drops to Tom Owen Evans, tries to control. Back to Ishmael again, right footed, blocked away. Plays it low, it's headed away at first attempt by Carl Perry. Sedend on the other side of the penalty area, skips past his man, low in towards the box, and it's drilled through. Tom Owen Evans was there at the far post. He's gone out for a goal kick. Kuyar couldn't get a touch on it it's from two yards out. Tom Owen Evans. Couldn't wrap his right foot around it, found the side netting. Kuyar and uh, Ishmael wins the ball. Klukowski's running forward here against the charging goalkeeper, tried to slide it through his legs. It was a lovely ball forward from Ishmael in the end to find Klukowski onside. Should have taken it round him, would have got clattered. And uh, O'Neill finally takes a few further steps back. Right footed strike over the wall. Brandon Hall in the right position to catch it. Didn't even need to parry it wide. Gets a good round of applause from the Edgar Street faithful.